I'm Snapper Jack and welcome back to the Outer Worlds. Uh, it's the top one, I think. Must be this one, right? Go be here. Let's find out, shall we? We've got so many different saves. I should overwrite all the all the original ones, but I can't remember how I can't be asked <laughs> to be honest. Um I do like the artwork on the on the on the loading screen. It's pretty cool though, I like it. Like different planets as well, it's pretty cool. Okay, where are we going now? Uh, hold on, what are we doing first? Oh, okay. Okay. Jazz hands. Full status effect and duration. Mm. Let's do arm rating. Let's do his range rating on. He's got two, okay. Uh, melee damage as well. One more as well. Just hands. Range weapon reload speed. Yes, please do that as well. Sam. Um, oh, God, yeah, okay. Let's do his health. Yeah, range down as well. Um, let's do that as well. Companion, what's this as well? As oh, one more as well. Okay. Um, reload. Yeah. Where are we going? First of all. City in the stars. Okay, so okay. Oh, it's uh, Terra Two. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, it's a different area. That's pretty cool. I like that. We are now in orbit above Byzantium Captain Terra Two. Byzantium. Is that how you pronounce it? Good luck, Captain. Thank you. Let's get, um... Yeah, let's get... Let's go Felix and provide. Actually, let's... Nah, nah, forget about it. Because these are my favourites at the moment. Farty and, and Felix are pretty cool. Byzantium, that's pretty cool. Is <laughs> that... It looks like BJ's. <laughs> Revenue BJ's. <laughs> it's it's not that style you pronounce it. 
by bio a bio that's a in a that's in a, like a what's that a bio is a you know a dock in it something like that from what I remember I might be completely wrong on that yeah bio yeah of course it is it's got to be so how you, is that how you pronounce it bio Bio's a dock, in it? Oh, I can't remember. I might be completely wrong on that. Okay, so we're, we're feet, we've talked to these people now, are we? Oh, she's right down there. Oh, wow, she's got frizzy hair. Do you mind? I'm needing someone. Yes, Phyllis. Phyllis sent me. Shh. No names, okay? The Phoenix is a wanted man, and the board has eyes everywhere in Byzantium. Byzantium, okay. Let's get this over with. I have information. You have information for me. Yeah, you're looking to make contact with Minister uh, Magpie, right? Magpie. I should warn you, it won't be easy. He spends most of his time in this estate, which is heavily guarded. It's got. Uh, it's got to be a catch. The minister, in some ways, less protected. Afraid not. He almost never leaves his home, and his guards never leave him. Uh, can you get me into the minister's estate? Whoa, I'm not one of your B and E specialists. I just provide intelligence. Okay. Okay, what can you tell me? Some of the guards hang around Billingsley's house of inebriation between shifts. House of inebriation? Count me the hell in. Maybe you could do some reconnaissance there. You know, swipe a key while nobody's looking. Thanks for the tip. Just remember, you didn't hear it from me. Okay. Okay. God, how... This is a bizarre place. I'm assuming that's a door that I can open. No? There we go. Yeah, this place is huge. There we go. Actually, I wanted to fight you, but I've got an eye okay, anyway. She's quite cool. I like her. Felix is awesome. Oh god, this place is mental. Hey you. Yeah, you wanna be famous? I don't want to talk to you, sorry. Interesting. Prosperity Plaza. More like consumption junction. Get it? Oh, the frame rate is dropping a little bit. Forsyth Luxury munition, Munitions discovered. Okay, it's guard over here. I can go in here? I can go in here. Okay, warning effects. If you've got epilepsy, don't play this game. Um, hello. Hey, 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 stand back, you. I'm part of Minister Clark's personal detail, and that means you got to keep five feet back at all times. He's supposed to be, are you supposed to drink? Yeah, you're not meant to drink on the job at all. Of course not. <laughs> but I'm not on the job right now. The others took me out to celebrate on account of me just getting hired and all. Uh, what's so important about guarding Mr. Clark? He's basically the most important person in the colony, which makes me the most important guard in the colony. <laughs> yeah. That means I got a key to the minister's estate, my own personal UDL assist issued shotgun. <laughs> they don't give those out to just anyone. Congratulations. Yep. Yeah, I've nearly made it to the top, my friend. 
Is he drunk? <laughs> He's slurring a little bit. Anything you can tell me, Mr. Minister Clark? Oh, um, he's a uh, medium height with like medium colored hair and like a kind of a medium face. Just like in his poster. Medium height, medium hair, and medium face. How descriptive, yeah. Oh, you definitely recognize him if you saw him. He's very important. How about I buy you a drink to celebrate your promotion? Yeah. That's a great idea! I'll have a Spectrum Vodka. There you go. Here's to me! <laughs> hey, you are really great. Have I told you that? We should be friends. <laughs> wow, listen to me. I'm so... <laughs> I should probably slow down before I'm... Face down on the tile somewhere. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I could, I could have another. You got another? Yeah, why not? Yeah, there we go. Have another one. It's not every day you get your dream job, right? He's going to get absolutely wasted. Wow. You got like this. Okay. I'm <laughs> He's getting really drunk. Jesus, I'm getting this guy absolutely fucking plastered. Crazy energy. <laughs> Has anyone ever told you that? You're like a, a manosaur. You got a manosaur energy. Oh, laws. I gotta stop. I'm seeing at least two of you. Only two? You got a ways to go. Have you always been here? I didn't see you a minute ago. You know, have another one. I really shouldn't. I'll have the worst hangover tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I, I imagine so. Yeah, that's a problem for tomorrow, eh? Yeah. You know, that's a very good point. Yeah, that's it. Get even more down here. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. Was that one supposed to taste like purple very crunch? Or am I just tasting breakfast? I don't feel so good. I think I'm gonna be sick. Well, I imagine so. You've just drunk like loads of. F <laughs> fucking idiot. Let's get in the room, because. There you go, done. That was easy. I got him absolutely hammered. Oh god, how do I get across this area? This is a maze. I have to get over there. You with the hips, over here. Let me take a closer look at you. Ah ah ah! Don't speak. Hold that posture for a moment while I admire you. You have a natural contraposto, my dear. The way you rest your weight against your hip suggests a certain rugged charisma possessed only by the mighty primal and the well-traveled spacer. Oh. Splendid. I love it. Well, I'm definitely in there. Um, that's the most pretentious <laughs> thing I've hear, I hear all day. You know what? I'm gonna leave. Your walk, your posture, the cut of your clothes. You carry yourself with the bearing of a noble, but you dress like a barbarian. How deliciously outre. I'm Celeste. What's all the way I dress? And you, my dear, are exactly what Byzantium needs. I like you. I like you. Like, it's like you read my mind. Darling, oh, this is like teenager talking right now. <laughs> of yours have been on my mind the moment you stepped into my studio. I'm working on a new line of clothing that will shock this city to its core, and I'd like your help. What do you say, my dear? Care to make history with me? Uh, no. Consider it a standing offer. Alright, see you around. 
That was bizarre as shit, let's be honest. Where am I going? This place is an absolute maze. I need to get over there. God. This place is an absolute fucking minefield of a maze. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, up the stairs. Um, okay, we'll go past you, thank you. Oh god, Jesus Christ! This, oh, hold oh, on. No. Oh, it's broken, of course it is. Jesus Christ, this is huge, this area. I have to go up and around, okay. Citizens, today marks a monumentous occasion in the course of Halcyon history. After a deep and thorough examination of our rights, revenues, and the international states, built on the backs of the working class. Okay. Hey, that was good. Gotta write that down. Missions abound, thanks to your continued This property is off limits. Solicitors, loiterers, and uninvited visitors will be fined to the fullest extent of company policy. This ultimatum brought to you by Universal Defense Logistics. I'm here to see Mr. Minister Clark. That's funny. The minister isn't expecting visitors. And you don't much look like one of those couriers from HPS. Sure am. Sure you are. And what is it you're delivering today? Typical. Why don't you come back when you're ready to actually make a delivery? Let's just save quickly. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be really stupid. Hold on. Just, just charge in there and hope for the best. This is so stupid. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm not gonna die. Oh, Stre S S Spectrum Vodka is the guy I gave the other guy. Uh, the uh, just a minute ago. Well, I've just. I've just <laughs> restricted area. Oh God, I'm gonna. I'm gonna die. Let's be honest. Oh, where do I go? Let's go to the top. Fuck it. How did you get in here? Where is he? Oh, he's there. I was like, why can't I see him? Hold on, let me just change the sensitivity a bit. Tick size is fine. Camera's good. Here we go. Sensitivity. There we go. Yeah, it's all good. 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 Make sure it's all there. Good. You! You just slaughtered those guards, and for what? To speak with me? 
What could possibly be so urgent? I don't know if I trust this so-called minister fella. <clears throat> that is his real name. If this is about another Aether Wave clip or radio spot, you may kindly fuck off, as the parlance goes. <laughs> I'm not enough. doing any more. Cut the crap. I'm here for. Oh, sol sol uh, sol sol sulfur 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 I can't pronounce that word. It's like acid. Drugs, of course. What else would it be? I don't have any drugs. You should try a vending machine or a purveyor of curative goods. I ain't buying a bus. I said we're checking for drugs. Will that be all then? I have records proving you've been uh, boarding. Okay. Yeah. Oh dear, I don't think I can say this any more slowly. Unless. Of course, of course. It's Rockwell again. Who else? And I thought he was only holding me here to keep me out of the way. Back up and tell me what you're talking about. Chairman Rockwell. He's kept me under house arrest for years. I've long suspected him of transacting business in my name. But this proves it. So the chairman's a crook who can't be trusted? Who knew? Please, this is important. Whatever it is that brought you here, Rockwell's the one behind it. Um, then I have to deal with him. Whatever Rockwell's doing, he'll be doing it from the HHC headquarters. Your best lead is to look for details in his office. If by look for details, he means knock things about and take what we like, count me in. That's certainly one way of doing things. Far be it from me to dictate your methods. This colony's problems have always seemed to trickle down from the top. We're set on fixing Halcyon. That's as good a place as any to start. Exactly. And fix it we must. Why, this is starting to sound like an issue of Dissident Hunter. Just tell me how to get in there. <laughs> Just... Via the Acropolis District, of course. That's where the most important corporate and government facilities are. But only board employees are allowed into the district. There's a heavily guarded checkpoint just down the street. There might be a route through the maintenance tunnels, but I'm afraid I don't know specifics. Most people avoid the area for obvious reasons. Once you get into the Acropolis district, what then? When you reach the HHC building, this access card should get you up to the executive suites, where the chairman's office and what used to be my office are. Then I'll be on my way. Wait! Brockwell has one of the only terminals capable of transmitting to the earthbound message drone. This is our chance. Please, take this and transmit it from his office. Brockwell hasn't given me any messages from Earth for years. He's desperate to keep me out of contact with the Earth Directorate. But they need to know what's happening here. What's on the cartridge? What isn't on it is the real question. I've gathered meeting minutes, internal messages, sustainability reports, and more. All exposing the corruption and mismanagement plaguing Halcyon. Once the rest of the Earth Directorate sees it, they'll have to send help. You're telling us you gathered up a whole mess of evidence on the board's corruption. How big is this cartridge again? Large enough, I assure you. That's why you must transmit the data to the Earth Directorate and hope for their speedy intervention. Good plan. Perhaps there is hope after all. And now I entrust it to you. Good luck, and trust no one in the Acropolis District. Okay. Okay, cool. Let's leave. No, we just killed our way through. Oh, God. Oh, it's back here again. Okay, we won't need to leave. Um, how do we go down? Uh, 
Um, okay. Oh, fucking stairs, that's probably why. I'll take that. So we watched a video of this guy called Rockwell who wants to take over uh, Halcyon, which is the planet that you are on now. So, right, so he's like the big bad. And they're, they're with the, they're called, called the board and they control everything, right? So what's, what's about? Well, the story of the game is to uh, save the colony because uh, Earth has been destroyed. That's pretty much it. That's the best way to explain it. So you have to find the colonists, uh, the rest of the people in the world, because uh, Earth is destroyed and... Um, you have to survive, uh, revive all the rest of the colonists. Pretty much, that's pretty much the story of the game. <clears throat> so this guy Rockwell, he's a part of the board. He's a big bad, and you have to take down the board at the end and save um, Phineas. That's it. And then he revives all the colonists. That's it. You have to go to planet to planet to get all the companions to help you with pretty much how the game works. Oh god, Jesus Christ. What? What's that? <laughs> Let's get rid of these guys first. That's it. Find out. Jesus Christ, I just killed a bunch of people. I don't think I should have done, but okay. <laughs> They're heavily armoured and they nearly killed me twice. But why not? Let's just kill everything. Why not? I don't think it actually matters towards the end, because at the end... Well, I don't know, because it's remastered, so it might be... The ending might be completely different. I don't know. I think the only thing that's remastered about the game is lighting, really. And a few more side missions. That is it. <coughs> so, I know it's got a finger. <laughs> it's like a finger pointing upwards. Oh, where is it? Oh, it's downstairs. Okay, so we're going there. Right? Let's kill everything. That's what, what do you mean killing everything? Well, that's pretty much what I've been doing anyway. So, of course, it is. Downstairs, because of this. So there's got to be a way that we can go down. Nice work, Captain. Thank you.
<laughs> I'm just stealing everything now. I've just lost the point right now. I'm just killing everything now. Well, it shouldn't be. <laughs> I don't think that's what you're meant to be doing, is killing everything. I mean, you can do. But it's not a good idea. Where am I meant to be? I'm meant to go down. Down more. Oh, here it is, still there. No? Okay. There's a door there. Barred, of course it is. Oh, here we go, there's a door here. Sealed. Oh, hold on. What does that do? Oh, here we go. Ah, oh, okay. I was gonna say, yeah. So it unlocks the door. I don't think I should have just killed all those people to be honest, but it was quite fun. Oh god, there's even more enemies in here. What's this like? Just kill them all, fuck it. I have to have this. Well they've got they've got ammunition, so they'll probably shoot me. And it's giving me XP as well. Okay, so I'm I'm a complete psychopath now. Right, okay. Just fucking murder everyone. Oh, switching. Oh yeah, I've run out, haven't I? That's probably why. Oh, find another weapon. Oh, yeah. Fuck, to your left. Let's go. Here, why not? in here so we need to go unlock a door or something surely can we go up go around Okay. 
Okay, let's chop down. Oh, come on, surely you can jump over there. I'm trying to glitch the game when I... <laughs> I reckon I can. Oh. There we go. Okay. Done. Let's leave now, shall we? So I've just murdered the the board. That's what they call the board. So I've just murdered the board, pretty much. Okay, fuck it. Let's just go back to the ship. Actually, can I just fast travel? Can I just fast travel because there's enemies nearby? Okay, fine. Well, now that I've just killed pretty much a part of a colony, um, <laughs> that just murdered everyone just for some chemicals, um, <laughs> how I did not die in that scenario, I have no idea. Um, Jesus Christ. Oh god, and now I've got to go back to um, Phineas's lab, I'm pretty sure. Jesus Christ. I'm pretty sure this will be the end. It's got to be, right? Yeah. We have successfully arrived at Phineas's orbital lab, Captain, and we are still in one piece. Shall I congratulate myself, or would you like to do the honors? Right. Jesus Christ. <laughs> there are three types of light and medium heavy, heavy armor provides the most protection. Okay, well, obviously, 
heavy armor protect, protects you the most, but you're slower when you have heavy armor, which makes sense because it's heavier. Now I'm kitted out with pretty much loads of ammunition and loads of health, it's not too bad now. Forget about the comments for a second. The colony is a verge of collapse. What? Oh, yes. Well, that's obvious. Anyone with two working lamps can see this colony slouching toward oblivion. Why do you think we've been doing all this? I revived you to help me save Halcyon from annihilation. Guess worse, the chairman's plan to freezing every worker in Halcyon. I found the chemicals, called chemicals in the ministry. Board was testing on human stuff. Yeah, they were. Human test subjects. Yeah, oh, that's, that's really test. bizarre. That's unthinkable. That's exactly what I'd expect out of the board. I let the ses, sub, test subjects die, but I brought back all the chemicals they had. Thank you. You've brought me enough chemicals to get started, at least. I'm just sorry they came at the cost of human life. Well, yeah, they drowned in chemical tanks. <laughs> Something about repeatedly reviving humans extended hibernations. What nonsense! People aren't just flats of meat. The board can freeze and thaw at their convenience. I'll tell you this much. The board scientists are hopelessly lost. After years of fruitless experimentation, they've made exactly zero progress. Focus feeling us how soon it's going to collapse unless we do something. We're out of time. We're out of chemicals. We may very well be out of options. If the board has their way, we're all going to be spending the rest of our lives frozen in stasis. Do you realize what this means for the hope? For your fellow colonists? The board's going to kill them all. Toss them out into space just to make room in their hibernation chambers. We need to think about this. This has something, something we can do. Short of lining up every member of the board and shooting them in the back of the head. Do you know what's waiting for us on the Hope? Scientists, engineers, artists, the brightest minds Earth ever sent us, uncorrupted by the board. The board's going to dispose of them all and transform the Hope into a prison for the rest of us. They're likely on their way to the Hope as we speak. We need to get to those colonists before the board. I have enough chemicals to start reviving a few of them, but no easy way to get them off the hope. Engineering. There's a way exactly safe we could skip the hope into the system. Yeah. Merciful gibbering law, you're a genius. We bring the hope to us. Skip the entire ship across the distance of colony space, right next to my land. Uh, the hope's probably damaged, we have to root power from the unreliable. Yes, yes, exactly. You're a step ahead of me, but I perceive the shape of your plan. If we link up the
the hope to the unreliable, then use your navigational computer to calculate a reasonably safe vector, we can skip the entire colony ship into the rings of Terra 2. I don't know much about skip drives, not the physics anyhow. I do know the hope's real massive. How is our bitty little ship supposed to skip it? Excellent question, my sharp-witted mechanic. You will use your own ship to power up the Hope's skip drive. Your navigational computer can handle the rest. I don't understand a word you said, Doc. All I know is, if we're gonna hijack a colony ship, count me in. Yes, excellent. I approve of your enthusiasm, young man. You should ask your captain for a raise. You'll need to switch on the Hope's auxiliary power using the unreliable. Then, head to the bridge. Your navigational computer, Ada, should be able to activate the Hope skip drive. Once you've skipped the Hope next to my lab, I'll have easy access to the frozen colonists. I can start reviving them immediately. Okay. I know you're wondering why I'm doing all this. Why I believe the people on the Hope are the answer to the colony's problems. The Hope is carrying some of humanity's most brilliant thinkers. Scientists, engineers, experts in their field. If we work together, we can still find a way to save Halcyon. The board would have us believe Halcyon is beyond saving. I choose to believe otherwise. If there's even the slightest chance we can save Halcyon from oblivion, then we have to take it. A gunship crashed on Monarch. I found the model inside. Which one side? So, that's what happened to the cantankerous canid. Oh, the board churned out nonsensical propaganda to cover up its disappearance. But I knew something was wrong. Parts failure, you know. That's why it crashed. A combination of human negligence and technological scarcity, leading to the tragic loss of life, leading to cover-ups. Sounds familiar. Yes, it's almost as if I'm suggesting the gunship is some kind of metaphor. But I wouldn't do that. I'm allergic to symbolism. For some reason you're hiding behind bulletproof glass. Yeah, I want to know. Oh, it's not you. I uh, do experiments in that room. Some of them get quite scientific. The unexpected is to be treasured, but uh, from a safe distance. Regardless, it's quite comfortable in here, you know. I have my beans, have my caffeinoids, plenty of toilet paper. Okay. You know, they're gonna make a serial about our adventures one day. I've been trying to think of a good title for this episode. I like the sound of the skip job. No, 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 wait, I got it. Hope in dark times. Get it? Hope? Like the ship. That's what folks in the business call wordplay. Not bad, Felix. Our adventure serial is gonna need a name too. Yeah, I've been thinking about that. Got a list right here. Thrilling tales of the unreliable. Or maybe spine chilling stories from the edge of the system. Was also considering astounding adventures in the other. I'm partial to that last one. Um. Squeeze the bridge of your nose. Um, to be honest, I prefer adventures of, yeah, I'm glad you're having fun, but we've got a job to do. Yeah, we got a job to do. We're hijacking a lost colony ship and slamming it right into the rings of Terra 2. Stealing the hope from the board, skipping it across the whole damn system. This is going to be great. I can't wait. I like your attitude, yeah. Enough to boost cool. my pay? I'm just kidding, boss. I know you don't pay me. 
<laughs> I'm sure you've got plans to make. As for me, I gotta keep practicing my signature dropkick. The Hope might have cameras. Yeah, huh? Actually, before we do that, there's some armor I want to see if I'm equip. So 24. We well, can get rid of that. Uh, what's her armor, armor like? 25. Okay, what's her like? What's her armor like? 14. You know what? It'll be the last mission, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to leave this one here. Um, <clears throat> I can't really remember the ending very well. It might be changed because it's remastered. The oh, I'm pretty sure the ending will be the same, surely, but I don't know. But on that note, I'm going to actually going to leave this one here, and I will see you in the next one. Take care and peace.